The Franklin County Fiscal Court has added vaping devices to the county's smoking ban. The court says they hope the new policy will help enforce social change. LEX 18 Jacqueline Nye reports. The Franklin County Health Department says that through their studies, they found kids who use jewels are going through two jewel pods a day. In one pack of cigarettes, there is 21 milligrams of nicotine, whereas just one jewel pod has 41 milligrams of nicotine. As more brands have come out, they've actually tripled the amount of nicotine. In the, I, think, I believe in the highest dosage, there's actually 91 milligrams in one pod. And that is part of the reason the Franklin County Fiscal Court added vape products to their already existing smoking ban. The vaping devices emit chemicals like acetone and pesticides. But when there is secondhand smoke and vapor that comes out of a device like this, you're not making that personal choice. Someone else has made the personal choice to use that device, and then it puts out a cloud of, of chemicals that can be very toxic and harmful to you in, in the long run. Magistrate Sherry Sebastian says the court is trying to be proactive instead of reactive. When things are not as prevalent to you and you're not uh, having access to them as easily, it does help diminish the capacity for somebody to say, okay, I think I want to try that. So now it's not right in your face, so they're not doing it as much. The county joins 16 other Kentucky communities that have a ban in place. In Frankfurt, Jacqueline Nye, LEX 18 News.